Claudia is a fine dining concept with a more than 10 course casting, tasting menu and a unique beverage program. Joining us now with a look at a few of their spring cocktails is beverage director Stephen Miller and the best bartender recently yes, titled. Congratulations. Thank you. Yes. Thank you very much. Yeah. We got Bunche, little, yeah. yeah, we got a little uh, preview in the commercial break of why that might be so. This is these are fancy. We're yes, doing fancy. We're yeah. still trying to have fun. Yeah, so that's what I mean. Two different drinks here for you, based off of uh, the menu we have currently, which is like a Midsummer Night's Dream captured in cocktails. Titania is one of the main characters, and so we wanted to figure out a way to bring her to life. Okay. So we start with the passion fruit mousse that's sitting in the glass here. Okay. And then we say a little bit of the monologue that Oberon has. We say there sleeps. To Tanya, some time of the night, lulled in these flowers with dances and delight. Oh, wow. Wow. And so what the is the delight? Passion fruit mousse is on the top, uh -huh. and then it gets activated with squid ink, uh, yuzu liqueur, and then a uh, brown sugar shochu from Japan. Ooh, that, so wow. that's spectacular. You get two of those, okay. one for each of you. Yes. This is so fun. And you wrote the descriptions of the cocktails in Shakespearean verse. Yeah, rhyming couplets is usually how like uh, a Shakespearean monologue will end. So each of these cocktails has a like rhyming couplet description that uh, tells you what you're about to enjoy. Okay, so should we do this with a spoon because you have a mousse no, on it, top? No, see how it's melting? Yeah. The citrus is melting the passion fruit. So these are actually just ready to go. Okay. Perfect. All right, so this was the design here. Squid cool. ink, huh? Squid mm -hmm. ink. These are beautiful. That just brings out the color, adds a little bit of salt to it, and it's then it's balanced out with all the other flavors. Ooh. Passion fruit that pops is at the good. end. Yeah. I hope so. Yeah. yeah. You can taste the mezcal, a little bit of the smokiness. Mm -hmm. Yes, the yes, I do. And mm -hmm. rounds it out right at the end. With right? the fruit, mm -hmm. yeah. Wow. Mm -hmm. That is creative. We're trying our best, yeah. Yeah. Well, how do you top this? Well, we try and do everything as a, a team. So mm -hmm. there's a small group of us, and Claire McDonald is my lead bartender. Mm -hmm. and she was given the task of coming up with a spicy umami driven drink um, and she went ham she went crazy <laughs> she uh, wanted to play with a few different flavors that we didn't have featured at the restaurant at the time so she chose gochujang and kimchi brine wow. so when you have kimchi you know in your fridge and yeah. you're sitting there and you get down to the bottom there's all that brine that mm -hmm. still has a ton of flavor in it mm -hmm. so she took that juice added gochujang to make almost like a paste yeah and then completed it with a uh, sweet potato based shochu uh, that is on the table there uh, mm. that has this interesting like savory tone to it okay she paired that with uh, a three-year aged uh, Guyana rum and then just finished it off with citrus and it creates this like spicy almost like bloody Mary style cocktail. like I had I had a hint of a almost like a dirty martini in my head until you threw the rum in there and then I was yeah. like wait I'm confused <laughs> it's just it's a lot of fun a little taste here for you both lime is the the driving force for the citrus and it just uh, has a brilliant orange beautiful. color come off of it. Mm -hmm. And that's really from the gochujang, which is a beautiful is spice. A fun spice, yeah. yeah. So now we kind of understand why you got best bartender here. Right, because no you kidding. put so much into these drinks. And it goes along with the Michelin star that the restaurant has gotten. Yeah, it's a group effort. Everyone pitches in to try and create each and every one of these things. And our idea is Ooh, that's how do we... Fun add ingredients oh, wow. that you might not expect. That little yeah. spice pop is nice, oh, yeah. but it's, it's not like overbearing. No, like, and no. Mouth isn't on fire. I have never liked um, uh, Bloody Marys, mm -hmm. but so I get a little hint of a Bloody Mary, but it actually tastes good. Right, no tomato <laughs> juice. That's always no. been my biggest yeah, fear with too. those. So like every time I make them a Bloody Mary, I do it with like tomatillos. Mm. Got that's it. really okay. fun. Those are like more bright and citrusy, mm, yeah. more like green flavor. Mm -hmm. uh, See, and so because Ooh. it has the kimchi in there, it's some mm. good gut health. Yeah, stuff you going know, that's where, that's where we're really going for here. Yes. yes. You get those probiotics healthy, yeah, in your life. Yeah. Yeah. So how, say, how many of these cocktails have you done in the Shakespearean style? So there are 11 of the Shakespearean cocktails, if you take a peek. They're all illustrated by Tom Keating. And the beautiful designs are here, so you get an idea of like what you're about to taste. Ooh. And then like when I present it to a table, I kind of read it like a storybook. Ooh. Um, so you kind of get lost in that. We have other cocktails available too. We have a whole menu of what we call baller cocktails. These are things featuring some ingredients you'll never find in another list. We're using like rattlesnake pachuga. Oh. So that's coming from Chihuahua. 
using a sotol, and that is featured in a margarita. You'd usually never see that, and the price tag reflects it at fifty dollars. But it's yeah, you yes. got an eighty-five dollar one here yeah, too. Yeah, based off Lord. of my, my favorite anime, um, Cowboy Bebop. So oh, Black funny. Dog Serenade, one of my favorite episodes. Oh. So it's just a whole bunch of fun references and just exciting drinks that you might not expect. I mean, you were an artist. I, I this mean, is yeah, art. Try our best. Yes, and well, we get you to succeed. enjoy it. Yes, yes. cheers. I think this is well, my favorite. Thank you. I yes. like them both. I'm, I'm kind of torn because I like the spice on this one. Well, it matches no. my outfit. So yeah, that's the idea. I had to go we with what we yes. yes. And this <laughs> is just the cocktails, folks. Claudia is also the Michelin star restaurant with a wonderful menu. So check them out on Damon in Bucktown, ClaudiaRestaurant.com. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sheila.